Hello everyone, uh, this is Mehita Bin Mahi and here I am today starting working cycle animation. Okay, as a beginner, it's a it's first uh, it's first part and left part will be uploaded soon, part by part. So okay, uh, here I am starting. Firstly, here I have taken and rig body which is totally rigged all over all the body parts and on the another part I have uh, open walking cycle animation just I have type it on Google and then there uh, find many of image sources and I have selected this one I have selected this one because it is quite quite easy to understand what is the step should be in a body which you push your character make a good walking cycle so okay here firstly contact it's uh, it's it's uh, realize you that body should be under this line and this high this high uh, position will refer you it is the highest position where your body will stay for uh, upwards to the ground so okay here I am starting firstly this rig body okay this rig body I have only screened in my viewport the lower part you have to understand and you have to be noticed that all all of the work is done to your legs so here you have to first give importance to your lower part then you give importance to the upper part to more realizing walking cycle so okay I have screened only lower parts in my viewport and then from channel box I have select all these and starting auto key and press keyboard S so okay one key has been fallen this is my first pose of uh, my first posture where that body should should be in a contact position that contact position is like similarly your first leg or your forwarded leg which you have to be called uh, or which you uh, which you named your leg from your position I have I have select this is my first leg and this is my behind or my second leg or this is my forwarded leg and this is backwarded so okay my first leg should be in straight position and second leg kind of point a little a little and which and which will touch the ground in slightly so okay here I have fallen the first key and in the last position suppose my key is 50 so I have select same key uh, same key as like this position and press keyboard S button so okay you can see two keyframe has been fallen which is my first contact position and the other position other contact position which is like a uh, like cut in this image you can see this so okay here now I have dragged my key and select keyframe to at 25. At 25, I have I have select this contact position. This contact position or uh, the another leg, the another leg which will be forwarded. That's the position. So okay, you can see first position my forwarded leg is 
right is straight, kind is straight, and the backwarded, uh, uh, backwarded leg uh, quite or small blend, blended. So okay, in twenty five frame, I have, I have turned it in opposite, in opposite, like my backwarded leg will be straight and it will touch the ground and my forwarded leg will be back Sorry. Here I have rotated these two up on. Select this, and in the screen I have select the value according to its perfectness so okay as it is uh, auto key has been um, activate has activate so at 25 frame and key has been fallen now you can see these things on the other hand you have to be remember that your translate say value should be same in the last frame because if you doesn't if you uh, didn't same this value there that movement which that body is passing on passing on the way it kind of unsimilar and unmatched for your current rhythm so for this curve you can select this key as it is should in middle i have same as it should and just negative that key value so okay now you can see these things okay so it's like um, as you know to a principle uh, one of post to post principle it's kind of post to post principle I have fallen that key and now I have I have selected uh, I have create in betweens in keys so okay now my low posture low posture where your body will be at lower position or at kind of connected to the ground more so okay here I have just down your body and your forwarded legs should be touched on the ground on the ground kind this way and your backwarded leg should be untouched from the ground like this way and um, my toe up I will make it perfect as my posture okay
uh, my second posture has been created now my third posture my third posture where the forwarded legs will be straight and body should be in kind of high position kind of not most so okay the forward leg will be straight straight this way okay and the back and the backwarded leg like this way So okay, this is my third posture and my fourth posture and my fourth posture like my first uh, my forwarded leg straight my car my body will at high position at high position the first leg will be so okay now it's kind of feeling like of that and now my fifth posture it's okay My, my sixth posture like again my back 
my recorded leg should be straight in forward and the body will be contact position like what it leg contact position okay this way and on the leg should be this way In here, I'm just So, okay, uh, my seventh posture like the quarter leg uh, body should be passing away, the quarter should be straight. My forward leg should be in forward and that toe should be in kind of back. This should be in and in the last posture that mm, should be like this my backward leg should be in this way forward leg should be kind of plain body should be at high position which the quarter leg should be like this way okay this is the step this is uh, normally that step and it is just look like this way okay here it was part one in part two i will show you to manage all the systems where where you have to weight your body which way are uh, which position it's it is just uh, just only five percent have been done in this video 
and another video you will see all of the principles of your working cycle so okay stay tuned with us thank you i hope you guys enjoy this video